What's good everyone? I hope you guys are all doing super well. I have a confession to make. I'm in the process of editing a hopefully very, very banger video. From every single video across my channel, this is probably the most creative video you'll ever see. As of now, of course. And for that reason, I really haven't been paying attention to what other video ideas I should have because I've just been so focused on this one big project. That being said though, I really don't want to lose my consistency on this channel. So today I present you PS Cook's collection of video games. So basically, this is a super chill video. I'm just going to be showing you guys a bunch of video games I've had from my childhood up till now. So let's get started. Now, if we're talking childhood, you know I got that Game Boy, baby. This shit right here is possibly one of the greatest creations of mankind, yo. I got so many games for it as well. Hold on, dude. I got Ratatouille, Avatar, The Last Airbender, The Burning Earth. Are you crazy? Madden 2005, which I haven't touched. Teen Titans 2. Oh my. Mario and Luigi, Superstar Sega. This dude used to scare me as a child. We got a racing game called Thunder Rally, Super Mario Brothers 3, Backyard Sports, some random ass third person shooter game called Special CT Forces, Pokemon Emerald, Kirby the Amazing mirror and finally le creme de la creme pokemon special pikachu edition these are all the games i have for game boy and yo i'm not even gonna lie i dead ass might buy more in the future out of all of these games the game i've probably played the most is this game right here this game is so awesome even though i'm not a fan of turn-based combat this game somehow managed to make it fun the expressions that mario and luigi make the freedom of traveling wherever you'd like to go the different boss fights this game is fantastic yo moving along with portable gaming devices we got the ds i have so many memories with this shit what game is loaded Oh, this game's sick. I remember taking the DS onto my bus almost every single day when I went to school. I used to actually have a TTDS. If you guys don't know what a TTDS is, it's basically, I don't really know what it is, same shape of a regular DS game so it could fit at the back of here. And inside of that one game or like one chip, I guess you can say, there'd just be games jam packed from top to bottom that you can actually download online from a website. So I guess in a way it is basically just downloading games illegally. So what I used to do when I was young, I used to sit my mom down and this US, oh fuck, I've used this USB so many times to download different games for my DS on the TTDS chip. I don't have the TTDS on me right now because I traded it with my good friend back in Jersey. Shout out Kaleem, by the way. My friend had a duplicate for both of these games. So what we ended up doing when we met, I gave him the TTDS and he gave me both of these. And that's not too bad of a trade, man. I have some hard copy games for the DS as well. We got Ben 10, Protector of the Earth, Gardening Mama, Goaded Game, Ben 10, Alien Force, American Dragon, Jake Long. If you remember this show, you're an OG. And finally, Cooking Mama 2. This game, dead ass out of all these is probably the best one finally moving on to our last portable device we got the psp baby the psp was so ahead of its time it's actually insane i got this playstation when i was very very young my family was at best buy with my mom's brother's family and as a gift uh, my mom's brother ended up copying me a psp i would say psp has the best looking discs or like hard copy bro it's literally a kanye album but yeah i got toy story 3 and i got daxter as well this game is sick i have the cover of daxter as well look at this cover man it's just so sleek it's, it's so nice feast your eyes on this fam i also got need for speed most wanted oh my god but that does it for the psp go to generation now next we move to what i think the best console of all time is the Wii, baby. The Wii is the best console of all time. There's probably a huge debate out there, just like Goku versus Superman, on how what the better console is, Wii or PS2. In my personal opinion, I definitely think it's the Wii. Wii had so many things going for it. It was literally a new technology. The sensor at the top, where in some games you can actually interact with. The amount of accessories for different games that came for the Wii, such as the nunchuck, and just the sheer amount of classics that the Wii gave is insane. Some of the games that I have from playing Wii are Lego, Batman 2. This is nowhere near the first Lego Batman, but still crazy game. We got some random bootleg 101 games. I I, I don't even know where I got this. Spider-Man, friend or foe? Oh my god. This game is so sick. Dude, I didn't even clock in. Look at this. Blockbuster quality guaranteed. I've seen so many people shit on this game saying it's one of the worst Spider-Man games. Completely false. This game brought so many new ideas and concepts to the actual theme of Spider-Man based games. You can literally do multiplayer in this game where you can box one another with different Spider-Man villain and characters. And the boss fights in this game? Holy sh- Next up we got Ben 10 Ultimate Alien Cosmic Destruction. This game is nowhere near the other Ben 10 games but a still very solid game. Next up we have one of my favorite Wii games. Donkey Kong Country Returns. Now let me tell you something right 
right now. Donkey Kong Country Returns is better than any Super Mario Brothers game. I'm talking about the OG Mario games where you get from point A to point B with a bunch of obstacles and enemies in your path. That's basically what the Donkey Kong series is for the Wii, but it just shits on every single way Super Mario Brothers has done it. The creativity of levels of each world that you're in, the atmosphere, the movement, Diddy Kong himself, this game just does everything so much better than the entire Super Mario Brothers series franchise. All in all, once you pick up Donkey Kong Country Returns, you're thoroughly invested in it. Next up, we got Lego Star Wars The Complete Saga. I'm gonna be honest, I saw this at Dollarama for like two bucks or some shit like that, so I just picked it up. Next up, we got Wii Fit, bro. Oh my god. Although this is like a fitness program for the Wii, the amount of cool activities you can do in this game is mind-blowing. Go to game. Actually, go to game. Next up, we got Batman Brave and the Bold. Really good game. It gets repetitive at times but it is a hack and slash next up we got ben 10 vilgax attacks another goaded game we got skylanders this is probably one of the most creative ideas for a video game ever we got the best mario kart out of every other single mario kart game to exist and finally we have the greatest game on the wii super mario galaxy i can't even explain how innovative this game is it's actually insane there's just so many new concepts in every single level it's never dry the amount of different costumes you can turn into the boss fights rosalina oh my and that concludes the wii game and for the final console, we have the PlayStation 4. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't have the PlayStation 4 until 2018. Before the PlayStation 4, I actually had an Xbox 360. However, there was one game that literally made me dump the 360 and cop a PS4. Spider-Man PS4. I remember seeing the trailer for Spider-Man PS4 thinking to myself, I need this game. So I literally put my Xbox 360 aside and I looked for deals for the PS4 on the Facebook market. After a bunch of looking, I found the craziest deal I'll ever see in my life. Some guy was selling an entire PS4 Slim, two PS4 controllers, seven or eight games, an HDMI cable, and a charging wire for the PlayStation. And all of that was literally $380. At the time, if you went on Best Buy, the PlayStation was around $420. So I I immediately contacted a dude and I got my PS4. But other games I have for the PS4 include Hunting Simulator, never touched it. 2K17, I haven't touched this game either. I played 2K19. Advanced Warfare, garbage game. Payday 2, another garbage game. The Division, never touched it. UFC 2, really, really fun actually. Lego Jurassic World, never touched it. Watch Dogs, played the game, eh, it's alright. The classic GTA 5, the best. Mm, actually, I don't know. I was gonna say that this GTA is probably the best GTA there is. But one can argue that GTA. San Andreas is a better GTA. I honestly don't know. If you guys have a preference of which GTA you like, it doesn't have to be San Andreas or GTA 5, put it down in the comments. And my final hard copy game that I have for the PlayStation, Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. I don't have the game right now because I lended it to my friend Alex. You better be finishing this. Over the past couple of months, I've been debating whether Sekiro Shadows Die Twice or Spider-Man PS4 is the best PlayStation 4 game I've ever played. And I've come to realize that Sekiro is levels beyond better than Spider-Man PS4. For those of you who don't know what Sekiro is, the easiest way to put it it's basically a rage game i've had my fair share of frustration with this game trust me one of the bosses actually this boss right here in total took me five hours he had like three full health bars and every single health bar there would be like a different attack set but the combat in this game the fluidity the story even the story is amazing really really good game there aren't a lot of games that i would play again but this game i would definitely play twice i'll wrap it up baby. so that being said that is the end of ps cooks games from childhood up till now this was a very sit back video i hope you guys enjoyed it the big project video that i'm talking about is still being edited i'm gonna try my best to push it out as soon as possible for you guys because if it turns out good this could possibly be one of my favorite videos on the entire channel saying so thank you for watching once again subscribe like comment tell me about your favorite video games whatever 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 and i'll see you guys in the next one peace